what's up hey you guys what's up good night anyways i don't usually start my vlogs off at night but what else we decided to um stop at this bar to get us something to drink so i got three clicks and babe get got like guinness yeah i was drinking one so there was only two inside the box but yeah these are some bohemian bears they were collect goals we have regular collects and we have collect gold um, we also stopped at Bamu Shah to get us something to eat. I got burger and fries. I love my burgers. Okay. Um, that's the next local Bahamian place as well. So, yeah. And good night. Here is me. Good morning. Good morning, guys. So, it's the next day. Um, hey. Let me tell you something. I don't know who needs to have this. What's this? get some rest get some rest I'm telling you I woke up in a totally good mood this morning <sighs> yes the day was rough because I was tired as fuck and when I'm tired it's, when I'm sleepy I'm tired so it, it basically like ruins my whole day you know that's, that's some serious thing like you, you need sleep. Your body really needs sleep. Sleep is very important. <sighs> oh my gosh, I feel so much better. Brianna only woke up twice last night, so oh, I'm so happy for that. Oh my gosh, so I cleaned the house. I cleaned up last night so I wouldn't do nothing. So I wouldn't have nothing much to do um, the day. Okay, the only thing I have to do is mop and fold those clothes. That's the only thing I have to do. Um, I'm taking a day for myself. Not the whole day, but three hours for myself. I'm sending Brianna by my mother for three hours. Um, every time I go to Brianna's appointment, the doctor, she always asks me, am I taking time for myself? I'm not going to lie. Being a mother is hard. You know, it's... Keeping Brianna is a full time job, and like you get you get no breaks, okay, none, and you need a break. You know, she always tell me, please take time for yourself. If you need a a day for yourself, take it, okay. But I really don't have nobody that could watch Brianna. My mother, she works. And I don't know. Sometimes I feel like my boyfriend is a little selfish a little selfish. Sometimes, you know. I feel like he wanna enjoy his free time. And I don't have no free time at all, you know, to enjoy myself. So I'm just that's why I clean the house from last night because I'm, I just want to relax. You know, sometimes you just need to reset and just relax. I just want to put up my leg. I was even going to scrub my foot today, but I'm not doing nothing. Okay, I'm going to sit down and drink me a bottle of wine and chill. Not the whole bottle, like two cups. Because I don't like, I don't know, like you guys, like I'm getting older. I don't like that feeling. I don't like the hangover feeling. I don't like the drinking too much alcohol. Even though, you're, even though you're not going to get a hangover, I just don't like it. Like, two to three cups is be good for me. Like, I don't like to feel oh, bad. Especially now that I'm a mother and I have to be constantly watching Brianna. It's like, no, I'm going to be irritated. Like, me feeling all woozy and I have to watch her? No, it's a no for me. So, I don't know who needs to have this, but girl, go check on your pregnant friend. Go check on your friend who have like four or five children. Girl, go check on them. Okay? Ask them if they need a day off. I don't know if y'all got under four or five children, but... <laughs> okay. Go check on your friend who have one child or two. Okay? Go check on her. Make sure she's doing good. You know, um, so, this whole motherhood thing was an experience for me. This is a very good experience because it teaches... It, it, it taught me... 
not to have no more. Okay. And uh, if you want to go back for more, that's on y'all. But baby, uh, there's a lot of work. I don't. I don't have. I don't have no baby. I don't have my baby. It's not like other people's baby. So everybody' experience is different. I feel like I have Brianna in my arm constantly. My baby's not the type of baby that sleeps. You know, takes three hour naps and shit. This girl literally takes like ten minute naps. The minute I put her down, she wakes up. When she's in my arm, Brianna will sleep for one hour. The minute I put Brianna, she wakes up. I, I really can't get nothing to do. It's very seldom that she sleeps over an hour through the day, okay? But her sleep pattern is, is way better at night now, okay? The only time she wake up is for food. Or sometimes she might stay up a little hour extra. But other than that, girl, I can't get nothing done through the day. And I be sleepy at night. I let my boyfriend sleep. I give him, like, I let, her, I let him put her down to sleep. And I just do the night work and early morning work. And I know, and I've noticed that every month or every different week is something different about her. Like she's always changing and growing, so it's always something new. I don't know what I'm gonna expect in the next week or so. Okay, it's, it's something always different now. It's so hard to put her to sleep now. Like she twists and she turns and she and she cries and. She gets mad like she wants Brianna Brianna will be sleepy like I will rough Brianna for an hour because she's groggy and fussy and she's trying to sleep and she, she's scraping up her face you know how babies do that they trying to sleep you know and I would do all of that rock her sleep for a whole hour just for her to get up in 10 minutes like girl I'll be working hard my back Everything be hurting. My legs are still like noodles from the lip. That's a whole new. That's a different whole story, girl. That's a whole new. That's a whole different story. Recovery. Oh, gee, I'm still recovering. Next week will. Next week will make three months. I'm still recovering. Oof. Lord of mercy. The things that women go through. Mm. Be careful who you love these children for. I'm talking so much. It's like seven minutes. Oh my gosh. Anyways, let me go. I have to mop the floor. Let me mop the floor. So I'm just getting ready to go um, to take Rihanna by my mother. Um, I'm in pajamas, girl. Like, when I come back, I want to be comfortable. No hair, nothing. Like, I'm Rihanna's girl. Ready to go. Like, girl, uh, I just want to relax. I don't want to think about nothing. I don't want to do nothing. I'm going to read my book and drink my wine. And that's it. Okay. Well, anyways. When Brianna reached with my mother. Hey y'all, so Bri is um, by my mother. We just dropped her off. Y'all, I haven't been in the front seat in so freaking long. Oh, my ass. That back seat is very uncomfortable. I do with some burrito. Anyways, so I'm on my way to the bar. I have to get me a bottle of wine. I don't have none now. Got my wine glass. And the next wine glass what I got from home broke. Like what the hell? The fancy one, not the plastic. This one's the plastic one. Oh my gosh, I'm so freaking pissed. Anyways, I'll see you guys at the bar. Glass while I'm thinking in my head. Mm -hmm. I mind my own, I don't even break a sweat. Oh, this matters, is it safe? Why you still live in vain? I'm not the one, you're the victim of your own mistake. Guys, so. Um, it's like after two. I stop on chapter six. Um, I was reading. So I was reading sixteen and nineteen affirmation. Okay, that's actually a year in the book. I thought that was just a number of affirmation or whatever like that. That's a whole year in this book. What happened in that year? And I was reading it and I started to break down and cry. I was like, "Fuck this! 
Um, I'm not gonna read no more. So I'm gonna finish this up tomorrow. I'm not gonna read no more, and I'm drinking wine super, but it's not the wine because I'm, I'm still on my first cup. Okay, the wine hasn't even hit yet. But I started to cry. Like I said, like history starts to make me angry, and you know what? I'm so glad that I had my child for a black mom. I really am a black mom that takes care of the child. You know, like sometimes I, I don't know, it's like I can feel their pain, like I feel what they've been through, you know. But I can't really imagine. But what I'm trying to say is that I, I can feel it, but it's nothing to compare to what they went through, you know. Like, like I just can imagine what um our ancestors went through, like rape, beaten, uh, body parts chopped off. Like, bro, could you be? Could you imagine as a child, um? You be t- you was taken away from your family by force. Like you were sold, you not know, treated like an animal. Like oh my gosh, right? I just can't fathom. I I I, I can't. Like and that's that's why I can never get through um to watching like a whole documentary or reading something about slavery because I always break down and I just feel just so my knees are down, you know. But I don't want to put um, hate in my heart, and I think the or- the author of this the author, I don't think I'm the author of this book. I think he's a Bohemian. Yeah, he's a Bohemian. But you know, the tears that start coming on my eyes just flowing. Like, oh my gosh! Even like the recent events he mentioned inside the book, like. Let me look back because I don't want to get the lady name mixed up. It's a few of them. The lady who was found um, hanging inside um, herself. Like, I remember that story. And I was like, what the fuck? A lot of others. Yeah, Sandra Bland. I hope I'm saying, I hope I'm saying her name correctly. Sandra Bland. That happened in 2015. Yeah, I remember that. Girl. Anyways, I'm just gonna finish and enjoy the rest of my wine and get to, um, I might as well read, um, finish reading Anne Frank. Yeah, I'm gonna read a, a few pages from that as well and just go with it. I also, like, um, write down, like, notes, like, or just words from the book that I'm not familiar with and study it, you know? learn them learn what they mean and stuff like that because like i say i want to enhance my vocabulary or whatever like that but yeah i'm gonna read a few pages from Anne frank because i really didn't have no time for myself i'm not gonna lie i didn't have time to read the last week or you know study things that i wanted to study so i'm just using this free time and i'm gonna be home in the next hour so let me just use my time and just relax i'm not gonna go to sleep because it don't make no sense. Oh, y'all, but now let's just back home. Y'all, look at how my mommy hugged my baby buckle up. <laughs> I can stop up laughing. This is serious, but I can stop up laughing. Her arm is even in. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Oh my god. <laughs> but now let's laugh. <laughs> and my boyfriend didn't even check the look at how my mommy had a buckle up. <laughs> he didn't even try buckle up properly. Banana should come here like this. Oh my god. And a brown paper on the hair. Listen to me. This is really Caribbean. Like, for hiccups. Brown paper on the forehead. Girl. <laughs> the black thing on the hand for for ghosts. Girl, listen. I got a message from my mommy. And I asked her how she had my baby buckle. <laughs> At least you can stay in the car, see? Right? Bananas, you miss me? Bananas! Oh, Lord. Okay, let me go see about my job, okay? <laughs> Lord, I made my day. The car seat. It was not funny, but it was funny because, you know, safety is first. But Lord, I can stop from laughing. 
once my boyfriend <laughs> is on the job, he don't care about the fuck is going on. Like, he all about that money. He won't go, 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 go. He even check Brianna car seat. Like, anyways. Mm. I'm drinking some water. Mm. I had like two cups of wine. Cheers, Louise. I need to put on some pants because I took off the hot pants, girl. <laughs> I was like, after the wine got in my system, I was like, girl, it's getting a little hot in here. So I took that off. Anyways, let me send the beer. I don't know how much footage I got, but hopefully I got enough. Because I've been talking, 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 talking. So <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Let me unloose my jaw. Let me unbuckle up. <laughs> girl, I like it. I'm still laughing because her arm is not even girl in the brown paper and black. Bye. I'm out.